welcome to American Baker in Germany, where the ingredients are German and the baker is American. I'm Michelle, and today we are continuing our bread baking series, and this time we are making an oatmeal bread. I actually found this recipe, or some, well, not exactly this recipe, but I found a recipe for an oatmeal bread in a very old newspaper article that I was reading for Microfiche Microphone. And I discovered that they had this whole technique and I was like, dude, I want to try that. <laughs> that would be perfect for American Baker in Germany. So, uh, so let's get started. Let's start out with our ingredients. We need two cups or 450 milliliters of milk, one cup or 80 grams of rolled oats, four tablespoons or 60 grams of soft butter, half a cup or 170 grams of honey, four and a half teaspoons of dry yeast, half a cup or 110 milliliters of warm water, one and a half teaspoons salt, two and a half cups or 315 grams of whole wheat flour, about three cups or 375 grams of white flour, egg wash which is optional. Start out by combining oats, butter, and scalding hot milk in a bowl and stir until the butter melts completely. Allow to soak for an hour and a half or overnight if you'd rather do the step ahead. Over time, the butter will cool and rise to the top so it will look like this. Stir it up a bit, add the warm water, yeast, and honey. Stir in salt and whole wheat flour. It will look a bit like a bowl of oatmeal at this point. Add enough white flour to get it to bread dough consistency. It should be around three cups. Knead it in when you can no longer stir it. Allow to rise about an hour. Knead briefly, split into two loaves and place into two greased bread pans. Brush with egg wash and sprinkle with oats if you want. I like this just so you can see from the outside what kind of bread it is. Allow to rise for another half an hour. Bake at 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 180 degrees Celsius for 35 to 40 minutes. This loaf was still hot when I cut into it. This bread is lovely and wholesome. It feels healthy but is still soft and fluffy. It's very nice to eat.
I hope you enjoyed the recipe today. For more recipes and tutorials, visit our website at AmericanBakerInGermany.com. We're also on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. Subscribe for more recipes.